Put up this drama hour, it ain't no time to carry the nerves and hands claiming got the street to get the shower. We're sweet without the shower, we're black without the power. We're semi BB without loud records, a little loud. Come out to neck the pounds of the king, who the fuck crown you? A mean flow with his ratchet, which one you going about? The shots is lifting off, bagging, slipping power. Making his way to the ring. From Queens, New York, weighing in at 158 pounds. Yeah, the man. The party, the pounds are fucking barbed. Cause it'll really part to like drum and bass. Yeah, here to start, to start off this night, night guys. I might go out and check twice when I saw this match listed as our opener. I mean, it could very well have been our main event. The piece for Marty, but goes around, comes around, howls full of karma. Gonna get your fucking head blowed off. We can carry these guns for show. Hang man in the puddle of blood on the floor. Big shout to the Alpha Men's Commission. And his opponent, I'm on my night job, y'all niggas job and I'm back up in position Earn hard, I'ma catch some niggas slipping Burn hard on the track and get the whip I'm on my night job Why it's always black to get the tension For my nigga with the pants to get the flipping Boy, that trap is an accurate description I'm on my night job Finally got Bossy off the corner Hope 10 niggas thought he was a goner He duck shots, now his boss, we got a phoner I'm on my night job Flew the posse out to Roman Won't tell you about no Bossy yachts, don't want them Nigga word the Selassie, yeah, I'm zoning I'm on my night job Got old niggas trying to bite cause they can't capture The feeling from the days where the game passed them Niggas out here looking like a bunch of Dame Dashes Nicorette, that's patchwork That ain't better than your last word Cigarette, let the ash burn on them Instead of that's worrying about the last word I'ma hit the gas word on them I can't think of Too a better match to kick the night off Like going to be a lazy Being an artist, that's the best excuse For being crazy I've been so infatuated Went to clock and graduated Now she on my FaceTime And my nigga, she just masturbated Fuck an album release party I'm out in the street, shorty How many rappers I kill? Counted at least 40 Now I ain't got but shorty down on the knees for me, I'm horny like that Cold Train album. I love Supreme, that's Cold Fade album. Lately, I've been dancing like a Soul Train album. Lately, silly making songs talking about how they hate me. They've been loving me this whole time. My only adversary was my own mind. Killed my ego now, snapping like it's 09 with a gold mine and inspiration for y'all. Fuck your cold sign, that nigga can't fuck with cold neither. Don't ask for a feature, we bring up. I would be remiss if I didn't mention, and it's important to remember amidst the chaos of a triple threat match, that victory can be achieved in many different ways, and that it's every man for himself. Guys, I'm interested to see if any alliances get formed here tonight, or if it truly will be one-on-one-on-one. -on -one -on -one. Wow, what a leg sweep! And then, ooh, that might have just broken something. Impact.
Oh, and a snap there. That'll give you whiplash. Looks like he's starting to sweat now. He can't rest on his laurels here. There are two other guys in there that want this match just as much as he does. He's got to be careful here. While he hasn't absorbed too much punishment yet, triple threat matches have a way of getting out of hand very quickly. This match is so evenly contested right now that it's almost impossible to pick a winner. I guess we'll just have to settle in and enjoy the action. At 2016's Clash of Champions, it was another classic triple threat match for the Raw Women's Championship. It was Bayley versus the boss, Sasha Banks, versus the champion, Charlotte Flair. The match started out more like a singles match between the boss and the queen. Bailey learned very quickly that it was every woman for herself. As Corey mentioned, Daniel Bryan versus Kane from 2014 provided scenes we never thought we'd see. Most notably for me was Bryan carrying Kane back to the ring via a forklift. That's right up there, Michael. But let's not forget, that was also the match where Kane went through a flaming table. Severe damage being inflicted to the back. This is what makes him one of the best in the business. Oh my God, well, that'll do some serious damage. I gotta say, watching this match, I'm definitely seeing similarities to the May 2016 Extreme Rules match, where Roman Reigns defended his WWE World Heavyweight Championship against AJ Styles. Beautiful technique. The end may be near. This might not have been a wise move for him here, Michael. Eventually, John Cena and Seth Rollins changed the landscape of the match by doing the one thing they never could. Nicely done as he gets out of the submission. Color me surprised, Michael. I did not see that one coming. There may be no escaping this fireman's carry. I don't know. Never say never, Cole. Tell you, watching Extreme Rules matches make me happy. My end ring days are behind me. You talk about a treacherous environment to compete in. He's not looking good here. He doesn't want to let this match get out of control, guys. Don't write him off just yet, guys. From what I see, these guys are pretty evenly matched at this point. That's all right, Cole. The no disqualification stipulation in a triple threat match can take the battle in many directions, and each one is more unexpected than the next. A superstar can be attacked with a weapon and can be assaulted by an individual who's not even signed to compete in the match, and the contest will continue because everything's legal. To know that someone could go in for the big one. Nasty impact. I knew it was only a matter of time. Here he goes. Oh, what a slam. He's back in control here. Your whole body hurts after a move like that. Oh, you might be kidding me. Back of his neck. Oh, uh -huh, it's over. He goes for the cover. Digging deep for a kick out. Not yet. Harsh impact. Oh, this could be bad. This, this could be really bad. Is it? Here it comes. He's got him. They get over me. Oh, man. man, what impact. I think this is the beginning of the end, Michael. Oh, it's over. What a triple threat. The sounds of the best niggas to ever do it. They're still doing it the best. This is where the sound Those three superstars laid it all on the line, as we can see right here in these clips. Put the freeze nigga, who was here to his chin. I don't care who's the last piece.
take that shit off. You know for sure we ain't playing. We ain't here. I'm saying it's a queen's thing, man. Yes, we said we ain't playing. Here is your winner. Yeah, man. We said the queen's thing. We ain't playing. 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 We ain't See him in flock, speakers just pop, engineers tweaking and bop. Used to post up, nowadays I creep on the block. Younger cats who don't.